It's been 22 days, about three weeks, and it's time for an update on the uh, jar culture of this tomato plant. So here we are, about three weeks later, and uh, this particular tomato plant, this is a dwarf variety. Only is supposed to get about 12, 14 inches in hydroponics, and spreads out quite well. Uh, so what I wanted to show you was that uh, three weeks later, from about this height, we are now at about uh, almost uh, 10 inches in height, and so it's coming along quite well. This is only a half gallon jar. It's glass and I used a net cup rock wool and some media around that and I just filled the nutrient water up to the base of it. There's no uh, air stones. All it is is just Cracky hydroponics. Having communicated with Dr. Cracky, uh, this is not exactly anything that he promoted uh, because the nutrient level has to be maintained. He has a couple uh, well-known methods out there and this is just an adaptation. The nutrient that I'm using is uh, Dynagro 795 and I'm using that at half strength. You're going to find that uh, your plants are typically more thirsty than they are hungry. I have an unpainted section of the glass. I can actually see, maybe you could tell a little bit, those are roots from the tomato plant that are starting to grow down into the water. The LED light is made by GrowStar, nice quantum board. I'm going to provide uh, the, what's called the uh, PPFD map. Uh, for this, uh, just so you could tell from the hanging height uh, what the uh, amount of light is that is useful to the plant. So if you want to do a similar project, just get yourself a jar like this, a little spray paint, a net cup that fits, and it really does not matter much what you put in for the media goes around because all it's doing is stabilizing the plant. You could even use decorative items such as these glass beads if you like to put this indoors and have it look a little bit nicer.